What do you think about sending troops to Vietnam? I don't think they should send people there. If the Americans want to start a fight or start a war, that's their business. Why should we be involved in it? There is blood on your hands, government, for sending conscripts to war to die. There was a lot of discussion about the war and what was going on in Vietnam. It's all about money, capitalism, greed, power, land, nothing else. This barrel held the immediate future for 40,300 young Australians who have registered for national service. Not old enough to vote, but old enough to die. The lottery of death, we used to call it. If you refused to register, you could be jailed for two years. I told them I wasn't going to register. And I can't back down from facing up to imprisonment. Because we resisted, we got arrested. We want to show by the size of the rallies just how many people were against the war. We develop strategies to manipulate the media. If you just do the responsible, respectable stuff, I don't think that by itself changes very much. We were enemies, we were traitors. At times I was followed. You'd be arrested, you'd be taken to an army prison. I thought, oh shit, they're coming down to kick me around. The day when we stopped the city was a very scary day. The horseback police were battening people in all directions. We said, well, we can't let the police get away with that. This is not anti-soldier. It's anti the policies that send soldiers to fight unjust wars. The more voices there are, the more that can be achieved. Everybody felt unified by this powerful belief and powerful feeling that we could change society. Fear and love. You may have